hi guys welcome back to my channel i post a new video every single day at 12 pm at eastern standard time subscribe to my channel and click on the bell if you want to be notified whenever i post a new video so today's speaker card is going to be about what did they hurt you and what is their karma for doing so i even have made a box the box of karma that i cut it um which a bunch of karma that we're going to pick at the end of each reading so today i have four pals for you this is pal one this is pal two this is pal three and this is pal four so choose the one you are most drawn to you can be drawn to multiple ones it does not matter but yeah let's start with the first pile hi pal one so let's see why did they hurt you and what is their karma for doing so so the first part is why did they hurt you okay so we have cow speed the miracles are endless number 15 down to six maybe you're 15 years apart or you hmm, this person you you dealt with this person when you were 15 or this person was 15 okay so what is their karma oh why did they hurt you Maybe you were somebody very generous and they didn't, they weren't, I don't feel like they were in love, whatever the connection you had with them. I don't feel like they like you for who you were as a person, but they like the fact that you were a generous person. Why did they hurt you? It's because you were somebody very good, very generous, and they took advantage of that, okay? Whether it int 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 uh, intentionally or not. Um you know when you're so generous when you're so good sometimes people don't even realize um how much they take from you okay because sometimes people are so used to take 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 and not give back and it's like when sometimes when you tell them that how much you're taking they're taking from you they don't even sometimes people are just in denial and they don't even want to see it in another perspective they're the on then their own perspective and maybe yeah maybe this person could not just just could not help from taking from you so because you were so just so generous so giving let's see why did they hurt pal one why okay okay it, especially it when um where they were in their life when they were with you it's that they really needed that okay maybe they lack they didn't have affection people that could give them affection like you did or people couldn't give give this give them like you did okay so it was just a bad timing for them but uh, a bad timing for you but a good timing for them because you were the person that they needed in their life but it's like they took advantage of that um because they did love affection and you know whatever you were giving this person okay let's see what else why did they hurt pal two why did they hurt pal two It's like you met this person when they were at their worst or not at their best and it's like it was the wrong timing for you but a good timing for them okay because that's exactly what they needed but yeah no anyways um we have this coward beetle spirit magic works through you number 52 down to seven and we have a well spirit a great mystery number 65 down to 11 okay so yeah maybe you don't need to believe in manifestation to be able to manifest and not and this person as well so um whether the whether you or them believe in manifestation doesn't matter okay so magic works through you um you're somebody that were 
a big you're a big manifester so you manifested a lot of things or you had a lot of things and did she so whatever it is that you wanted you manifested it very quick or in big quantity and that's what this person hurt you because it's like again wrong timing it's like they took advantage of that it's like instead of them doing the work it's like you do the work and they take whatever you have worked for okay so you could have you could be somebody that make money very easily or like this is just an example but you manifest a lot of things very easily okay because you don't have any attachments what magic works through so anything that you want you manifest it very fast or and um and big quantity and that person just could not help but take advantage of that okay because yeah not only we're a big manifester maybe you still are you probably still are but not only because you are a big manifester um but as well that you're generous you're giving because maybe you make a lot of money but money is not all that you and the fact that this person asked you money and you cared about them it's like you do not see any like nothing wrong with it but this person knew damn well that you were not gonna say no or that some way or another they would make you give them money okay so maybe they could have lied to you to ask you something to get something from you or maybe they they just knew how okay i heard pure so i'm gonna say so maybe they just knew how pure you are sometimes you know when you know someone you know like what they're gonna fall for like i was no matter how sick it sounds um and i feel like that's what the case for you and this person this person just knew your um weak points okay so they knew like how to get to you okay just a great mystery yeah again it's like you were get up gullible um you you would buy anything that this person would tell you because you would not like second guess what this person would tell you will tell you because you you trusted them and they knew that that you would no matter what they would say you would trust them you would not second guess it okay let's see what else is coming through why did they hurt pal one why did they hurt pal one Why did they hurt Palmon? Okay. Why did they hurt Palmon? Okay, thank you. We have Dragon Five Spirit Trade Transcends Illusion number twenty two down to a four. Okay, maybe in general you are somebody that could sense through people's bullshit, but it's like with this person, it's like you were blinded. Um, it's like this person was a blinded spot, okay? You could not tell what this person was saying because you did not thought that this person would ever lie to you or manipulate you or take advantage of you. Okay, um, yeah, you could be somebody that was about honesty and somebody that um, valued a lot of honesty, okay? So, yeah, and you were somebody very honest, so... You didn't think that people around you would wouldn't be wouldn't have the same value or preach the same things that she and they knew that. Okay, so it's like maybe you thought that this person was very honest, but in fact they were not. Or maybe they were, but it's like they knew one way or another, like how to make them pa make you pa pity them in a way. Hmm. Let's see, let's get one more. And even if you were to see that this person was lying to you, one way or another, they were gonna, like, it's like they were gonna, it's like they ended up making you believe them. So maybe they put the bomb where you're like, oh, like, why don't you trust me? Like, why did I do wrong to you? Or it's like, again, make them get pity from you to make you like, believe them so it's like they knew your weak points okay let's see 
because it's like they were very uh, they were at their worst and they really needed what you had or they're very needed what you were giving to them at this specific time okay but they could have just be honest okay but they had to lie because maybe they thought that she would not like accept them or not give them um give things to them be giving to them let's get one more why did they hurt pal one why did they hurt pal one why did they hurt pal one or maybe you dealt with them since 2015 because for some reason i want to focus on the 15 but yeah let's see why um why did they hurt Paul one? Why did they hurt Paul one? One more card, please. Why did they hurt Paul one? Why did they hurt Paul one? Why did they hurt Paul one? One more card, please. Give me one more card. Okay. Again, I saw the act as if almost come out. So yeah, putting on a mask. Maybe they were not that bad in a, in a, such a bad place, but maybe they acted like they were in a bad place, or they acted like they really needed something from you when in fact they really didn't. Here, life is a mystery. But uh, we have but yes, spirit. Life is a mystery. Number eight. Uh, there's something with eight, maybe 2018, uh, maybe the eighth month of, okay, maybe in August you have last death with them, or maybe this person was born in August, or maybe you are eight years apart. Life is a mystery. Why did this person hurt you? Okay, it's like this person took advantage of you as much as they could because either they knew or either they, they would, they had this feeling that they would never meet somebody else like you. So it's like they would take, it's like they would, they, they um, wanted to take as much as possible from you because they knew that when you were to discover what they would do to you or when you were going to leave them, they would never meet somebody else like you. It's so it's like they took as much advantage of you as possible because you never, it's like you never know when you're going to end your relationship, your connection, or they never knew if they're going to ever, they would ever to meet somebody else like you, which I don't feel like because you're okay, not to be shitty or a pessimist, which I'm not. <laughs> most of the time but it's so true like kind people are getting r more rare and rare okay so yeah anyways you're a gem okay so don't let people take advantage of you or don't let that affect you still be you okay you will st you will end up if you haven't yet you will end up meeting good people okay but don't change for them raggedy ass, shitty ass people. That's all I'm going to say. Okay, so now we're going to see what is their karma for doing so. So we have the Queen of Pentacles. Okay, interesting. Okay, the Queen of Pentacles to me is somebody that puts a lot of uh, hurt. Well, puts a lot of energy of time, energy, and efforts in, especially in a relationship. Okay, so... What is their karma for doing so? I feel like the tables have turned. So they open up to people, but they get they ended they end up rejected, or people don't really want them, or they don't have reciprocity. So they put a lot of work, energy, and effort in relationships or in connection, but they don't really receive that energy back. And they're the one that puts more energy, effort in a relationship in their connection. Okay, so. Let's see what else is coming through. Okay, I heard and they feel drained, okay? Emotionally, physically, I heard as well. Let's see, what is their karma for doing so? Okay, I heard arrested, okay, whoa. Let's see. Okay, 
You have the seven of pentacles. Okay, this person, what is their karma for doing so? This person is put on a hold, basically. It's like this person, it's like, for example, this person tells if someone like, hey, like, I have feelings for you. And this person is like, yeah, I don't know if I feel the same for you. But it's like, it could be one year later and they still haven't, this person still haven't tell them that they love them back or not so this person is put on a hold okay so if not rejected okay so it's like they never receive the love back or they always have to wait to end up being rejected somehow so let's see what is your karma for doing so i don't know how many cards i'm gonna get i'm just gonna go with um how i feel so why uh what is your karma for doing so to power one what is our karma for doing so for power one and as well the karma may depend on um the person that you were dealing with okay so for example if this was somebody that was really intelligent that had really good grades like a good karma for them would be that they fell in their classes you know what i mean like it depends on whoever you're watching for or whoever is watching this pal okay so feel free to choose a karma that resonates the most for you okay but let's see what is their karma for doing so to power one what is their karma for doing so to Belmont? Whoa, 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 whoa. I don't know what one, which one fell. Great. I guess a lot happened. Maybe their life is a mess right now. And that is their karma. I honestly don't know which one fell. But if it was meant to fail, we'll fall again. Jesus Christ. Like, it was so calm and then all of a sudden the cards fell. That was so weird. Let's see. What is their karma for doing so? I feel like all of a sudden, which... Um, by the how the fall uh, how the card fell, <laughs> I feel like this person's life was became upside down all of a sudden. Like things starting to happen, wrong things starting to happen, bad things one after another started to happen. Um, that it was like very like um, not out yeah out of the blue, but very like back to back, back to back. Let's see. What is their karma for doing so? I think I'm going to take just one more. What is their karma for doing so to power one? What is their karma for doing so to power one? Okay. Those two. <laughs> Let's see. We have the death card and the six of cups. Gemini energy. Uh, Scorpion energy and Gemini energy. Okay, so... What is their karma for doing so? They don't have long-lasting relationship, long-lasting long connections with people. Or it's always, there's always an ending of somewhat, okay? So, no matter how long the connection, uh, no matter how long the connection, no matter what type of connection they have, no matter how much of efforts they make there's always a handing somehow and they're stuck in the past they're nostalgic in the past and kind of stop thinking of someone or people in the past here hmm. because maybe they know that this is their karma okay and it, if anything this is just hiding karmic depths to their life okay to their other life so now let's get some karma from the box of karma <laughs> let's see again i don't know how many i'm gonna pick i'm just gonna pick intuitively what is their karma for doing so to power one what is their karma for doing so to power one what is their karma for okay this one i guess 
charge more for no reason okay so for example <laughs> okay so if they ask for coffee for example instead of charging the normal price you get charged more for some reason or if they get a haircut for example a haircut for example they get charged more than everyone else for absolutely no reason or if they get their car fixed they get charged more for no reason you get the point okay let's see okay Ooh, what did I say? This is, ooh, okay. I didn't even know. I didn't think it was going to be so um, resonating. Not resonating. So, um, I didn't think there would be so much synchronicity, but you guys, we have rejection. If you want to zoom in, rejection. Okay. But yeah, basically, like I said, they get rejected. Wherever they have feelings for or wherever they want to build a connection with, they get rejected, okay? Let's see what else do I get. What is their karma for doing so to buy one? What is their karma for doing so to buy one? Okay. Oops. We have okay underappreciated and you guys what did they say you have car breakdown okay so is there car breaks they have to be like i said charge more for no reason they get charged more for just no reason um we have oh we have and that's funny because I gave the example earlier. We have shitty teachers. Like, I have the example with bad grades. I know I put bad grades in this. But let's pick one more. Okay, if it's not teacher, if they're not at school, then it's, she, it's shitty buzz, okay? But let's see one that came out. Wrong place and time, okay? Wrong place, wrong time, okay? But yeah, that's it. That's what I have for you, Bal One. I hope this lesson's happy for you. And I'll see you guys next time. Oh! We have one more that came. I didn't even see it, you guys. We have Will of Fortune, okay? So, whatever they did to you, they got it, they got it back. So, if they cheated... This is just an example. I don't feel that necessarily, but... You did... Okay. If they take advantage of you, they were taken advantage of, okay? Whatever they did to you, it happened to them back, okay? And that is their karma. But yeah, that's it. That's what I have for you, pal. One, I hope this was a tough for you. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys. Hi, pal, too. So let's see why did this person hurt you? And what is their karma for doing so? And I did um, some karma. I did the box of karma where I put some karma. And we're going to pick some at the end of this reading. So, let's see. Why did they hurt you? Tur we have Turkey Spirit. Give it gratitude and grace. Number 61 down to 7. We have 90 Gale Spirit. Love is all around. Number 41 down to 5 okay there's something with it's like there's 61 41 so maybe you're this age or you were 61 dealing with the 41 or you were 41 dealing with the 61 or maybe you were you're something one okay so okay now maybe not 11 because i know there's nobody that is 11 watching me but maybe you're 21 31 41 you get to just or maybe there's something with seven so Again, 21. Well, seven balls pop at three is 21. So maybe you were 21 or this person was 21. Or maybe you were both like, maybe you were like some at something with one. Okay, so maybe you were 21 and you were dealing with somebody that was 31 or whatever the, the case may have been. Maybe you knew this person for seven years or maybe you were seven years apart. Okay, let's see. Why did they hurt you? 
yeah okay you were somebody very generous very giving okay you were you don't you don't care about giving with uh in order to receive okay so you're just wanting to be generous you just wanted to give to others without any in hell intentions without any intentions for that matter you just want to give to others because you know that you have you are more fortunate than some so you just want to give to others you just want to be generous you just want to be giving to others and that is what they hurt you because they knew that how giving you were okay how loving you were how caring you were and they took advantage of that like again it's similar to Palawan, so you may want to watch Palawan, or maybe you were drawn to Palawan. Love is all around. Yeah, again, you are very loving. Therefore, you attract people that are loving around you. And it's like, they took, a, okay, I feel like not only they took advantage of you, but they took advantage of the people around you. But then I mean, maybe um, they didn't have um, enough affection in their life. And they saw that not only you were affectionate, but people around you as well. And it's like, um, they just wanted uh, attention, affection from others, and they took advantage of that. Because maybe they tried to be friends with your friends, or to be close with your loved one, okay? Or people that you were close with, okay? Because they knew that you attracted similar people than you, or that's what they thought, okay? So, let's see... Why did they hurt Pao too? Also, I really want to say it. Maybe you were five years apart, okay? <sighs> okay, so we have Hummingbird Spirit. Be here now. Number 34 down to 7. Again, something with 7. So we have Armadillo Spirit. Sell earthy boundaries. Number 3. Okay. So, you're somebody that lived in the moment. So, no matter what this person would ask you or what anybody would ask you, you'd be like, heck yeah, like if somebody tells you right now, like, hey, do you want to go out? Like, do you want to do something? And you're like, why not? Okay. So, you're a go getter. You live in the moment present. And the, that's why they hurt you because they knew that no matter what they ask you, you were going to say yes or you would be down to do it. So, it's like they would always be able to spend time with you. Okay. Okay, for some reason, I thought that my uh, camera wasn't recording. I was like, oh my god. Okay, anyways. Okay. Okay, yeah. You you were just down to do anything at any time. And it's like, they were like, oh, like, you're my person to go to, like, for whatever the case may be. Like, if they were going to text you at a random time to talk to you, you were going to be there. Or if I were, if I were a random time... Um, they wanted to do something, they would ask you, like, you were the person to go to, no matter what, because you would always be there, and you would always be down to do anything, okay, without being, like, mad or pissed, or without being pessimist, okay, um, I feel like you would rarely say no, or it's like you would, you would always have time for people that you care and love, okay, like, you would always make time, or if you really couldn't, it's a if you would say no is that you really couldn't okay um you would really you were very busy and they knew that and it's like they took advantage of that some way or another it and it can be intentionally or not but you know when sometimes when somebody is so good people are just used to take 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 and not necessarily give it back and that's just the real tea here okay and set healthy boundaries again it's like you set a very healthy boundaries with people and again it's like they knew that you attracted people that were just the same vibe as you and they take advantage of that because they knew you had solid foundation with others so they take advantage of your solid foundation that you had with others um to have their own connection as if that makes sense let's see what else is coming through Why did they hurt Pao Tu? Why did they hurt Pao Tu? Whoa. Almost cringe here. Okay. We have Turtle Spirit. Slow and steady wins the race. 
number 62 down to 8. Okay, this person knew that you would take your time with people. You take your time with people to open up to people, to build solid foundation with people. And it's like they took advantage of that because it would make the relationship, the connection last longer if you know what I if you understand what I mean. It's like because you take your time building things, building a connection. It's like they took advantage of the fact that you would take your time. So it's like they would appreciate it if would they would um appreciate it's like they took advantage of the time of the fact that you would take your time to open up or to build solid foundation because again it would make the last the connection last longer or they would take advantage of that to make the long the situation last longer the relationship last longer or maybe that is them acting like they would want to take things slowly okay to to have more time with you somehow or one way or another Why did they hurt Paul too? I saw spirit as a plan. So yeah, again, this person at um. How can I put it? It's like this person had another purpose, a bigger purpose than just to be close with you, than just to be friend with you, to just be whatever the case may have been, okay? So they had others' intention than what they showed you that. So for example, if they were friends with you, they were it had a bigger inten intention, another intention to be friends than to be friends with you. Or if they dated you, they had a um other purpose than to date you, okay? Again, it's like they were try to it. They plan all that shit because it said spirit as a plan. So it's like they plan to be closer to you so that they can be closer to the people around you so that they can take advantage of you somehow here. So let's see. believe in yourself. Oh God. Okay. We have squirrel spirit. Believe in yourself. Number fifty-seven down to thirteen. Uh, twelve okay why did it hurt you is that maybe that was true maybe that wasn't but at the time you were dealing with them it's like they knew that you were not that confident or that you, you did not have a strong confidence okay you like any confidence and it's like they took advantage of that okay um i don't really have an example or i don't really know how they did that um but basically, why did they hurt you? It's like they knew that you were not confident. Therefore, it's like you needed them in their life. Or it's like you would not never reject them or be mad at them because you had your lack of confidence. It's like you didn't thought that you would meet somebody else better or helped. Okay, if you were to break up with them or if you were to separate with them, whatever the type of connection you have with them. And they knew that and they took advantage of that again. And it's like they took their, it's like this, um, they knew that you would take your time to open up and, it's like they took advantage of making the relationship, the connection last longer. And maybe sometimes they would use your lack of confidence as an advantage or they would use it somehow. Okay, so maybe they would they knew what your weak points were and they would like, you know, how can I put it? How can I say it? And it's like they would just re reopen some wounds, okay? And they knew that it was going to happen. Like, they knew it was going to work, okay? They knew it was going to work. Let's see. What is their karma for doing so? Okay. <laughs> this is the best way. Like, if I smile, I'm not smiling at you. I'm not laughing at you. Is this a... Uh, I'm petty. I can be petty sometimes, so... It's just I'm enjoying this, okay? Seeing what their karma is. Um, Angel Delaney. Okay, so what is their karma for doing so? Is that they all depressed, okay? They are sad. They are not happy. They could be in a full-blown relationship and they are not happy, okay? We have six of wands. Oh, why is six of wands there? What is okay maybe people around them but 
he, everyone around them but them are successful, have admirers, or people that put them on a pedestal, put them on the pedestal, people around them on the pedestal, not them. Everybody around them is getting success, recognition, fame, but not them. And they're sad and depressed, okay? Let's see. What is our karma for doing so to about you? Okay, I'm not going to take all those. What is your karma for doing so to bow to? Okay, I heard they have trust issues. Let's see. What is your karma for doing so to bow to? Okay, two cards fell on the ground. Hold up. Okay, it came like that. So, it fell like that. So, we have the Seven of Cups and the Four of Swords in the reverse. So, what is our karma for doing so? The Seven of Cups. Okay, usually the Seven of Cups is somebody that has a lot of offers or somebody that is out of reach. But I feel like this is them making a lot of offers to a lot of people but being rejected okay and instead of them being out of reach all the people that they want to build something with are out of reach so this person gets ignored or rejected even maybe but just yeah they just are with people that are out of reach basically they meet unavailable people just like them uh, if they were i don't feel i don't know why i said that but maybe they were you have the four of swords in this the reverse so they are restless they have a hard time sleeping or they feel like they're wasting their time um maybe they're stressed all the time as well or they feel like the time is really passing by they have a hard time sleeping at night but now let's speak some more karma from the packs of karma so let's see What is our karma for doing so to about to? Okay, we have one that fell. You saw it. We have a spell. Okay, so somebody put a spell on them or you spell you put a spell on them and it's working. If you put a spell on them, it's working. Or if somebody put a spell on them, it's working. Maybe you and somebody as else as well put a spell on this person. Okay, we have one that fell. Ooh, we have the boy would. Okay, if he wants to zoom in. We have the boy would who cried wolf. Okay, I can speak. But basically, whatever they tell to people, nobody believes him nobody believes them i don't know why i said him but nobody believes this person no matter how much they say it, nobody no matter how if it's true or not nobody believes this person okay because maybe this person was a lying ass i heard cheating ass as well interesting <laughs> i don't know why i heard that but it's like this person was so used to lie that nobody believes them now even if that's what they're seeing is true let's see Okay, we have two ten underappreciated again um, accident. So they had an accident, like maybe a car accident or some sort of accident, and that is their karma. Maybe they talk shit about somebody, and boop, karma happened right away. Okay, so maybe they talk shit about somebody they shouldn't have, and they hit their toe like in the corner of a door or of. Um, or something okay like could be a big accident like a car accident or just a small accident um here we have two tans so if they wanted if this is somebody that tans a lot or that get tan um for example if they get signed professionally it's like they got the wrong color okay or if they were to at the beach trying to tan they got two tan basically they didn't get the color that they wanted okay they got way darker than they wanted okay so
Let's see. What is our karma for doing so to Paul 2? I can't mix it, but I guess I thought he fell again because um he fell in power one chi. So we have car breakdown. Just what I said basically. They could have had a car accident or something like that. Oh, I feel like if this is somebody that maybe you you shared a car or you paid for the car that they kept and they ended up keeping, that's their karma. Okay, so again. Feel free to pick the karma that fix that fits for you because, um, yeah, maybe you're not dealing with the same people. Okay, we have. Well, depending on what uh, fits best for the person. So, if this is somebody that is very, for example, that is very intelligent, that have good grades, a good karma for that person could be that they have bad grades or bad teacher or really bad, um, teammates. Okay, so pick the karma that fits that resonates for you. Okay. Then we have crescendo. Okay, so one thing starts to get okay, one thing's bad happened to them and it started to get just worse and worse and worse and worse. So for example, um this person started to lie. Okay, they were used to lie and nobody believes them. Now they, they speak the truth, but nobody believes them. And now they stung their toe or they get stung or they eat their toe in the corner of something and now after they got they got a car accident or they got a car um breakdown and then they got an accident. Okay, so it just gets worse and worse and worse and worse, okay. I feel like taking some more and then that's going to be it. Whoop. Oh my god, it just it's just so synchronicity. We have invisible. So nobody sees this person, nobody cares about them. Um it's like again, they could have made offers to people and they got rejected or they got ignored, like I said. But I say one more you have mercury retrograde okay and you know like a few months here and there we have some mercury retrograde and and mercury retrograde it's better to it's known to be better that that it's better to not take any action but instead of being mercury retrograde for them here and there it's the whole year all the time it's mercury retrograde for them so whatever they do if they take any action on something, they get karma about it. Okay, so yeah, it's Mercury Retro for them all the time. But yeah, that's it. That's what I have for you about too. I hope this was insightful for you and I will see you guys next time. Bye guys. Hi about three. So let's see what is their uh, what did they hurt you and what is their karma for doing so and at the end we're going to take some karmas from the box of karma but let's see we have a one bad speed be at home number 63 down to a, a 68 down to a maybe they're 36 or 63 Okay, or they born in um I was gonna say it on the like which maybe they born in nineteen sixty three. Okay, number sixty eight down to a fourteen down to a five. Okay, so why did they hurt you? Maybe you were um single parent or you worked at home, and um they took advantage of that somehow. Let's see. I'm gonna get some more cards. Or they took advantage of the fact that you were a home type person. Um, yeah, you stayed a lot at home, or you would better stay at home, or again, you were about your home, so you were about your family. Your family, you, you your family oriented. And you took advantage of that. Let's see. Why did they hurt Pop? Three. Okay. 
okay they, they may have to maybe you were the head of the family or somehow uh, a lot of people um expect a, a from you so maybe they took advantage of that time for deep dive number six uh swan spirit time for deep dive number 60 down to a six again something with their 60s so maybe you were dealing with somebody that were in their 60s or maybe you were in your you are in your 60s right now so let's see time for deep dive okay it's like they knew that why they hurt you is that they knew that you had deeper issues or that you needed to work on yourself or maybe you while you were dealing with this person you were also trying to work on yourself but it's like they took that as an opportunity here let's see why why did they hurt about three why did they hurt about three we have a last spirit sometimes life stings number 64 down to 10 again 68 60 64 so something with 60 okay i don't know maybe you are born in your in uh, 1960s in the 1960s or this person was born in the 1960s um i don't know um yeah again you you they knew that you were somebody that was hurt or you just handed something that a cycle that was really painful or overall you have been hurt a lot in your life and they knew that and it's like they took advantage of that again i don't see really specifically why that is let's see why did they hurt about three why did they Again, you guys, I'm yo, I'm not bluffing. Again, 67, 60, 68, 60, 64, 67. There's something with 60 or the 60s. I don't know. We have a little spirit. Turn knowledge into wisdom. Number 67 and down to a 13. Down to a 4. Turn knowledge into wisdom okay maybe you're somebody that you know you make a lot of mistakes but you never learn from them and it's like they knew that about you and they took that advantage about that is that you're somebody that could never learn or you can never see the red flags and they take they took advantage of that and they knew that you were broken at the time or that you were really hurt or you were really in the dark place or having a really hard time at that moment and it's like they took advantage of that it's like there's no way like this it's like they, they knew that you were not going to break up with them or that you were not going to be like feisty or whatever because you knew that they were worse thing in your life than to deal with this person or to be mad at this person or to broke up with this person so you keep you kept them around but they knew that and they took advantage of that maybe you let them leave at your home live in your home live with you or yeah or something like that okay i heard apartment but if it doesn't resonate just let it fly why did they hurt Paul three? Why did they hurt Paul three? Why did they hurt Paul three? Why did they hurt top three? Okay, yep. We have dark spirit be loyal to what you love, number 19 down to 10. <clears throat> Again, you were so hurt at the time that you didn't have time to deal with everyone. Like you were just so focused on your situation, on what was happening to you um focusing on yourself on your issues on your problems on your dilemma and this person knew that um it's like be loyal to what you love you're loyal to who you love so basically it's like yeah they knew that you would not break up with them because you had feelings for them or it's like they never they knew that you would never kick them out because you had feelings for them no matter what would happen like if they, even if they didn't pay rent or didn't do some chores in the house you would still not kick them out okay because you again you're loyal be loyal to what you love so you were very loyal to that to this person and didn't you that and especially um the fact that you were in a very hard period of time they knew that you were not going to break up with them out of nowhere because maybe you needed them 
or you really wanted this person to be there for you and they knew that okay let's see why is uh why did they hurt pal three why did they hurt pal three Why did they hurt Pal 3? Why did they hurt Pal 3? Why did they hurt Pop 3? Why did they hurt Pop 3? Okay, I'm gonna pick intuitively if does. one doesn't come out. I just want one, okay? One card, please. Thank you. Okay, we have 11 Spirit. Learn from the past. Number 25 down to 7. Okay, so maybe you were 25 when you were done with this person and now you are in your 60s. Or maybe this person was 25 um, and now they are in their 60s, okay? So, events learned from the past. Again, there was still a lesson that you needed to learn or to take in, things that you still needed to take in. Or maybe they saw that there are certain things that you haven't learned or you haven't had a lot of experience as you have, as much as experience as you have now. And they took advantage of that because maybe, yeah, you were a newbie or very like a new, um, um, a beginner and it's like they knew that you didn't knew a lot of things or you were still processing the lesson to, you were still taking in trying to take in the lessons that you had to learn maybe in a very hard way and they knew that and they took advantage of that but let's see what is our karma for doing so we have the oh we have the i persist bnj initials could be significant to you or this person could have been a virgo we have the Page of Cups, Pisces Energy. What is their karma for doing so? Okay, this person attracts people that are very intuitive. So, therefore, people can sense this person's bullshit miles away. Or people ask around to ask how this person really is, okay? So, yeah. They, this person cannot fool nobody no more. Page of Cups, this person makes offers... Um, Wherever this person makes offers to, this person gets rejected or wherever this person apologizes to, nobody believes their apology because, again, people, they attract people that are very intuitive so people can sense this person's bullshit miles away. Let's see. What is their karma for doing so to Pal 3? What is their karma for doing so to Pal 3? What is their karma for doing so to Pal 3? What is their karma for doing so to Pal 3? Give me just one or two. Okay, thank you. We have the seven of wands. Okay, yeah, this person has trust issues. I love it. We have seven and seven here. So. Again, they could be 27, 67, whatever the case may be, something 7. Maybe you last met them in 2017 20, 20, uh, or something like that. Maybe you were 17 and they were 25 or maybe you were 25 and they were 17. Okay, or you were just 7 years apart. Seven of Wands, this person is very defensive. Okay, this person has trust issues and that is their karma or whoever you deal with. People have trust issues about them, again, because people are intuitive. People can sense this person's bullshit miles away. And nobody believes an apology, no matter how honest it may be, because, yeah, nope. Um, let's see. I feel I want to take one more here, so. What is your karma for doing so to Bob 3?
what is your karma for doing so to ball three okay thank you okay so we have the empress okay so this person feels drained okay this person is very virgo energy again so this person could be a virgo but again this person is very nurturing have that mother like energy or father like energy to people but um people don't reciprocate that energy it's like it's like this person is a father or mother to everyone around them like people ask them uh, um endlessly they always have to be there for somebody and it's draining them it's very draining them as you can see the card this person is very tired feels very lazy feels very drained so people see this person as a parent and it's like dad can you help me doing this or mom can you help me doing this and it's like they have like no choice or it's just like yeah and um, people always ask them to do something and it's like very draining to them but it's like they're the only people that would stick so they have to do what it is that they have to do but now let's okay well let's take some karma from the box of karma what is their karma for doing so to pop three What is there? Okay. Ooh, okay. We have flights canceled. So whenever they try to travel, there's always a, uh, some travel, a flight can cancel, and they have to stay longer at the airport uh, or something like that. Or maybe they're going to the airport and midway um, to the airport, the flight get canceled here. Or maybe they have waited for hours and the um, for hours for their plane. Maybe they I heard delayed. So maybe their plane were delayed at first and they had to stay longer. And then they waited longer and they <laughs> heard that their plane was canceled. Their flight was canceled. Oops. We have... bad co-workers okay what is their karma for doing so again you can pick your karma um pick the karma that resonates most for the person that you're watching for okay <laughs> um pick the most satisfying one so let's see what is their karma for doing so to about three Okay, like I gave the example for the other pal. So it could be somebody that has good grades, that is very good at school, but their karma for this specific person would be that they have bad grades or bad teacher or bad teammates. So pick the karma that resonates more the most for you. Okay, so what is their karma for doing so to about three? What okay. Okay, we have rejection. Like I said, the whole reading. But let's see again. Let's see what else. Okay. Yes. We have long waiting lanes. Okay. So no matter where they are, they could be at a restaurant and they have to wait hours in order to sit. Or wherever they are, they always have to wait, 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 and wait. Just like the example of the flight can. So that's so weird. I love synchronicities like that. Okay. So let's see. What is their karma for doing so to ball three? What is their karma for? Okay. We have. Anxiety. So again, maybe this person is stressed out because maybe they have to get to work and there's a long waiting line, right? So they're like, should I wait or should I just go where I have to be? What is their karma for doing so to about three? What is their karma for doing so to about three? What is their karma for doing so to about three? What is their karma for doing so to about three? What is what is their karma for doing so to about three? What is their karma for doing so to about three?
Okay. They don't really saw how many fell, but uh, that much, that much fell. But <laughs> let's see. We have, yep, cheaty teacher. We have breaks everything. So basically, anything that is that they touch, they break it. So they may always break their glasses, or they when they take their phone, it just falls and it breaks, and they always have to replace this. Or like anything that they touch, it breaks. Okay. And they always have to replace it. We have a very small tip. Okay, so where, wherever they get the work at, they always get paid like the the minimal, like not even the minimal, like in, in like um instead of being like paid a pity one dollar, two dollars, they get paid one cent, two cent, five cents. Okay, like very petty tips here. So they could work at a restaurant or whatever the case may be. It doesn't matter. We have, oh my god, we have slapped wrongfully, okay? I think that is pretty explanatory. I don't need to explain it. But yeah, that's it. That's what I have for you about three. I hope this wasn't sad for you. And I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys. Hi, about four. So let's see. Why did they hurt you? And what is their karma for doing so? And at the end of the reading we're gonna get some karma to see what this person had um well let's see we have parrot spirit watch your words number 44 uh 45 down to nine okay so maybe you're 44 this person is 44 or maybe we're 90 years apart or maybe you're something nine so maybe you're 19 you're 29 you're 39 or maybe that's the age that you were when you were dealing with this person you were something nine when you were dealing with this person so for example you were 19 when you were dealing with this person you were 29 when you were dealing with this person or maybe this was this person's age okay but why did this person hurt you okay it's like even if you you were somebody back then, even if you were somebody that were, um, and by by back then it could be literally a month ago because we change often. But um, yeah, for those who are willing to change, of course, not throwing shades. But um, it's like you were somebody. You could have been somebody that that was very bought. But you had a way, a very like <laughs> um, elegant way to roast people, for example, or to be still blunt, very honest, but it, not in a um, harsh way, okay? And they knew that about you and they took that advantage of that, okay? Or maybe they took the fact that you're a very good speaker. Maybe you were very good in English classes or in, in French class or whatever the class you had, okay? So your first language okay so basically you're very good in your first language and they knew that maybe you were in the same classes for example and it's like oh like you're good in this um in this um specific class subject and they took advantage of that because um instead of literally having to pay for a tutor that had free services from you so and they knew that no matter what they would do to you, you were not going to be very, like, mean to them. Or you were not going to act like a children like maybe they were. Okay? You were very mature for your age. Very mature for... Yeah, your age. I don't know what I was going to say. But, let's see. It's like they knew that you were not necessarily hurt this person. It's like you know some weak points or you know what would hurt um, about this person. So you know that sir, if you were to say certain things to them, you know that it would hurt. But you would never go that route, okay? Um, you would never be that petty, okay? You didn't want to be that petty and they knew that about you. And it's like they took advantage of that. Let's see. Why did they hurt Pal 4? Why did they hurt Pal 4? Okay, it fell in the reverse for some reason. So we have Hug Spirit. Let Spirit be your guide. Number 32 down to 5. Again, something with 5. 
maybe you were five years apart or you have dealt with this person five years ago or maybe you had a five-year relationship connection with them and this is so weird because we're in 2020 so five years ago was 2015 again something with five so five years ago was 2015 that's so fucking weird so but let's see let's be your guide Okay, with the let spirit be your guide in the reverse, I feel like <clears throat> you're not somebody that is a sheep. Okay, so basically you're not a follower. You're not um, gillable. And I feel like this person knew that. But it's like they knew that they would not be able to hmm, control you um, or something like that. But they knew that you would still not... Hmm, Okay, it's like they knew they would still they they would not they were not would not be able to control you one other person but they knew that if they were to do something you weren't you wouldn't like act like a child or you wouldn't be pissed at them necessarily you would just talk it out and they would like find their way out of it okay somehow let's see why did they hurt Paul for why okay Him in the reverse as well we have the sun paper spirit be playful be playful number 51 and down to six i love it's five five six maybe there's something with 556 or maybe hmm five and six so maybe you were five to six years apart or hmm, you knew this person about five to six years or you dealt with this person um, in 2015 and in 2016 or something like that. Um, okay, but let's see. Uh, it was in the reverse. Just remember it, but... Okay, with the be playful being in the reverse, I feel like this is a... F yeah, like I said, you're not immature. You're somebody very serious. Um, and it's like, hmm. You don't play, but at the same time, you're not going to create drama, okay? Um, you're you're not going to even try to create drama. You're going to be like, okay, like, it's whatever. Like, I don't want to be on wrong terms with you. Like, um but just don't do that again or it's like yeah somehow this person would always like um find their way out of it okay hmm. let's see why did they hurt Paul for why did they hurt Paul for okay I'm just gonna take the one that flipped we have the spirit be peace number 21 down to three maybe you were 21 again <laughs> um or this person was 21 hmm. again yeah i just said what i just said like it just a confirmation um of what i just said yeah you're you're, you don't want to argue or you don't want to argue for unnecessary things or you don't want the fight to last for too long. You're just like, okay, like, that's fine. Just don't do that again, please. Or you don't make drama out of big things or you don't get pissed, like, for no reason or for just, like, the smallest things, okay? Again, it's like they knew you would always forgive them or you would always find, um... an agreement it's like you would always find an agreement that would just um be fine for the both of you and they knew that okay let's see why did they hurt Paul for why did they hurt Paul for okay 
Why did they hurt the four? Okay. We have renew spirit, overcome any obstacles, number 50 down to 5. Again, it just keep pointing me out that there is something with 5. I don't know what that may be. Uh, maybe it resonates for you. I don't know. Okay, so. Overcome any obstacles. Yeah, you're somebody that you're maybe very thick skin or you just very strong mentally and physically. Okay, so. They knew that there wasn't like, hmm. It's like they knew that you, like, again, you're not a follower, you're a leader, okay? You have a boss like energy, and they knew that there were certain things that if they were to do certain things, it wouldn't pass through, okay? So they tried to, hmm. Again, it's like they, they use the fact that you were, you were not somebody, um, a drama person or somebody that was about drama and they knew that and they it's like they found the weak it's like this person find your weak points okay um which were very like i feel like it's i heard manipulative because it's like this person it's like um which is even worse because it's like this person got to know you in order to know how to use you to know what are your weak points in order to use you and they knew that if they were to do that certain things or say that specific thing that it would work okay no matter what and they would still do this bullshit or whatever they would still do okay we have the lizards but dream the world into being number 38 down to 11. okay so why did they hurt you maybe this person told you that they had a dream like oh like i want to become a successful or i want to have my own company or something like that well it doesn't have to be this is all with um, money but they, they told you that they may have told you that they had a dream okay and why did they hurt you i feel like they could have tried to use you to get closer to their dreams i don't know if there's an expression for that but it's like they're stepping on you in order to get higher to be closer to their dream or if that was not if that doesn't resonate then you were something that had a dream and it's like they took advantage of your dream for example let's say your dream was to be successful to have your own company but it took advantage of that and they used publicity from your company so that they they could have asked you like oh like, can you promote my business or can you promote my product um or they tried to find you know you could have had um business um workers like um contract um with some people and they may have even tried to have a contract with those same people or something like that it's like um either they stepped on you to get closer to the well did step what whatever the example that i gave they still stepped on you but it's like Hmm. maybe they try to yeah that's literally what i said but i was going to say um i'm basically repeating myself at this one but they try to use your connection to be closer to their dream okay to achieve their dream okay let's see yeah i feel like taking one more for some reason whoops i feel like taking one more for some reason so let's see again i have to act as if or i think it was again okay. i already know which pal was which so Let's see. We have a peacock spirit. Let it shine again. Yep, number forty six down to ten. Just confirmed what I just said. Okay, um, it's like this person used advantage of you. Okay, no matter what happened, they took advantage of you overall. Like no matter what example I just gave, they still, regardless, regardless, gave, um took advantage of you so with that i can see that this person tried to shine bright like a diamond okay so literally they took advantage of you to in order to stand out okay they're like went through your business your connection and to shine brighter like to be more success more famous 
or yeah they could have tried to use her connection to build their own business or maybe they used the fact that she had something very successful in something and they use advantage of the hard work that something that you have hard heard okay here in order to shine brighter than you or to try to let's say it like that um but yeah there's something i want to focus with 10 i don't know what it is there's something that may be resonated for you with 10 maybe they're 10 you were 10 years apart or maybe you haven't dealt with this person since 10 years ago or 10 months ago or maybe this okay 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 because to me 10 or in the tower 10 represents a ending right so <laughs> I feel like I just got that. I don't know why I got that. I just got that. But, okay. Girl. This person tried to take advantage of you, but it didn't last long. And it's not the part of karma, but I feel like that was their karma. It's like maybe people were like, um, they tried to build contract with your business worker and it didn't last long. Or maybe there was something false in the contract or there's something that happened and made your people not work with them. Okay, somehow. So yeah, this, this shine of this walk of fame didn't last long. Okay. Or it handed, um, some way or another okay now the best part let's see what is our karma for doing so we have the two of wands hmm. this person is indecisive or this person meets people that are indecisive okay maybe they hard they see somebody as their world and they 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 have no reciprocity about it okay so it's like, let's say they tell somebody they have feelings, right? But this person that they're attracted to doesn't want them back or it is indecisive if they want this person or not, okay? And that is their karma here. So whoever they love or they very cherish, cherish they don't really have reciprocity in that, okay? Let's see. What is their karma for doing so to about four? What is their karma for doing so to about four? Okay, nope. Okay, what is their karma for doing so to about four? What is their karma? Okay, I heard cheating on, okay? If main reason is for one person, okay, I'm gonna say it now, but um, like I said for the other pals, so feel free to choose a karma because, um, for example, the person that you were dealing, let's say the person that you were dealing with was very good in school or had very good grades, right? Um, a good karma for this person would be that they have bad grades, bad teacher, or even bad teammates. Okay, so feel free to pick the karma that resonates most most the most with you okay let's see what is their karma for doing so to buff for what is their karma for doing so to buff for again you have the queen of pentacles with it came out in pal one i think okay so they could be an earth sign, but doesn't matter. Okay, yeah. Whoever they open up to doesn't want them back. Okay, the Queen of Pentacles is somebody that, no matter what uh, gender they are, doesn't matter. But the Queen of Pentacles is somebody that puts a lot of work, time, energy, especially in relationships to me. So, their karma is that they put a lot of effort and energy into things and real especially relationship but they have no reciprocity they open their heart to someone they give they may have even given the key to their heart or even to their home but they get left out in the cold or just like keep wondering if this person wants them back if someone wants them back okay 
okay i heard ghosted you may have been ghosted now i'm, I'm hearing some papers that i put in my box for some reason but let's see what is their car okay the king of swords almost wanted to come out so we'll see if they'll show up again what is their karma for doing so to balfour what is their karma for doing so to balfour what is their karma for doing so to balfour what is their karma for doing so to balfour Just give me one or two, please. One or two. Okay, I think I'm going to pick intuitively because... You know, the cars in the other piles wanted to jump out and I don't know what is going on. This person is silent all of a sudden. Okay, I heard they may be sad. Interesting. Okay, I heard they I heard they have no words and then I heard I have no words. Okay. Hmm. This person is speechless. I think I'm gonna pick intuitively. I prefer to use take jumpers but yeah we're gonna stay we might stay our night here if we wait for a car to jump out or maybe that's it that's all they want me to pick here so let's see what is their karma for doing so to bow for is there anything else that wants to come out okay thank you okay ten of cups here What is their karma for doing so to bow for? Again, it's like they see some if they see themselves marrying somebody or having a family for with somebody, but this person doesn't want them back. Or mm, I don't know why I got this scenario, but maybe they got with somebody and they even had a child with somebody, but the person ran away with the child. Okay, it could be very specific. And that is their karma. Okay, I heard was not a good father for some reason. Or this could have been a woman. So, But that's, I see what I hear. So, Okay, or had not, didn't have a good father. Okay, so maybe this, this person had a very um, wrong, uh, very wrong, very bad relationship with their father. And it just pass it on to the this to them um to the next generation it's like people you know when sometimes people will be are like oh i don't want to become like my parents but they in fact become like they are parents and i feel like this may this may um this is what may have happened to this person why what is their karma for doing so to bow for what is their karma for doing so to bow for okay thank you okay i love again 10 10 10 there's something with 10 here again 10 signify endings but um again yeah 10 of uh once this person feels burdened feels sad feels like um the world is they have a lot of weight I forgot the expression, but they have a lot of weight to their back here. And they can take it all on. It's too much on them. They feel like they are in hell, literally. Or they feel like they are in fire. Like maybe their chest area feels like it's burning. They could be going through a heartbreak. Okay, but that's what I get here. Okay, I heard one more for some reason. This probably is weird. I don't know. I feel weird about this part. But um, I'm getting really weird information here. So let's see. Okay, one came out. Very sneaky. You guys like to see how the way it fell, you guys. How to see how it fell, you guys. So weird. It's like through here. So weird. Okay, 
we have the page of pentacles yeah with whoever they invest themselves in they may make they may make even super solid offers but they still nonetheless get rejected okay um no matter how solid the offer is they may get rejected whether this is a job offer people don't want them or it, even romantic wise okay or maybe um friendship wise but let's see some karma from the books of karma to see what this this person's karma okay what is their karma for doing so to bow for what is their karma for doing so to bow for what is their karma <clears throat> for doing so to bow for sorry if i'm losing my voice but let's see what is their karma for doing so to bow for this person ever since you okay ever since you have left this person or have done dealing with this person they may have even had had three endings already okay okay you have one here which is illness okay so they are always sick no matter how clean this person is they're always sick um somehow like even in the middle of summer they're sick for absolutely no reason or just out of the blue out of nowhere they get they get sick okay so i heard they stay in bed a lot of time a lot not a lot of time a lot okay so what is their karma for doing so to bow for what is their karma for okay what is their karma for doing so to bow for what is their karma for doing so to bow for okay okay we have <laughs> wrong place wrong time okay so they never are there in the wrong place uh, in the right place and in the wrong moments ever okay we have broken nails okay so their nails always broke somehow and you know how that can be painful sometimes so or maybe they could even talk shit about somebody and you know you know instant, instant karma is real you guys you know when i feel like this is that could they could be talking shit about somebody or they could be thinking about like oh like i wish this person was in my life but it's like they treated you like shit or they treated that person that they're thinking about coming back to like shit and they're like oh nope karma like don't think about this person like don't think about coming to this person i feel like this could be your if you believe in that of course i, I feel like it could be your angels your garden angels um protecting you somehow so super cute somehow like I know it's kind of dark, but let's see. I heard spell, but let's see if it'll actually come out. Okay, we have... Okay, this is pretty dark, but we have stopped. Okay, so not maybe literally, but maybe this person was cheating on you or this person betrayed your trust or betrayed you somehow, and this is what they got back okay or maybe since they cheated on somebody or they betrayed somebody they could be it could have been literally been stabbed in the back okay okay we have two tent okay so maybe they went to get tan professionally but they got the wrong tan like too dark than they wanted it or maybe they want to lay in the beach on the beach and they slept too much and you got tan way too dark let's see and to the point that you could tell that this is not their natural skin color so let's see what is their karma for doing so to bow for what is their karma for doing so to bow for okay let's see we have 
Okay, charge more for no reason. Okay, so they could have a car breakdown and they get charged for absolute no reason. Or maybe um, when they get a specific order, like at a restaurant, they get charged more than the others for some, re for some reason, for no reason. Okay, so, okay, love. It just resonates very much. Like, it's very synchronicity here. We have broke. Okay, so, yeah. Since they get charged more for absolute no reason they get broke very easily okay just love how that how that worked out let's see okay we have this one is pretty dark as well but we have a food poisoning so not only they had this is not only they had to pay more for no reason but they even got food poisoning and they got broke out of it oh that's so sad like i'm so sarcastic sarcastic <laughs> if you could not tell i'm all about karma but let's see some more what is their karma for doing so to for for okay we're gonna okay last shuffle this one fell my the one fell my hand okay i think we're gonna take one more that's gonna be it okay yep resonated so much oh my god and you guys saw me like they they're jumping like i'm not even taking them so we have a long waiting alliance okay so not only okay if you want to zoom in yeah okay so not only they have to wait to get seated at a restaurant they they get charged more for absolutely no reason and they get food poisoning and they get broke out of it like that's so sad. Okay, yep. They have more karmic debts, okay? They have to pay more karmic debts for their future lives here. So let's see the last one. We have clumsy, okay? So this is somebody that, if you want to zoom in. So, yeah. This is somebody that falls a lot, that sleeps a lot. Or, yeah, they could try to as simply add it as sitting in a chair and they somehow fall out of the chair okay or they slip in the stairs when they walk in the stair they could like slip or almost fall through the stairs or something like that like they're very clumsy like for the smallest thing maybe they try to take a water bottle and they somehow f make it fall okay or when they try to take their four and there's it somehow sleeps okay slip out of their hands okay but yeah that's it that's what i have for you about four i hope this was insightful for you and i will see you guys next time bye guys